Sean just ran in to get some fix a flat. What's up guys, Sean and Savannah here with Spencer's Lawn Care. We're rocking and rolling this morning, boys. We uh we just had a flat. We got done with a small commercial. Savannah noticed the back tire was a bit low, so threw a can of fix a flat in it real fast. Just a small one. I don't have the time today to run and try to plug it or anything. It doesn't look like a big hole. But we got some air in it. We're gonna see how it does here on the next one. And uh, yeah, basically, I don't wanna put new tires on this truck, guys, because I'm gonna be getting rid of it here real soon. So I'm trying not to put any more money into this truck than I have to. But we're gonna be up here. Let's get rocking and rolling. Anything you wanna say this morning, Savannah? I'm going to show you what some people do, what not to do, and then I'm going to show you the proper way to do a three-point turn or a turn on a zero turn belt. Alright guys, that's how not to do a turn on a zero turn mower. Show them the grass here. That is a rip in the lawn. That's from just whipping it around. That's from just whipping the mower around and the wheel actually ripping the top of the ground. Now I'm going to show you how to do a proper three-point turn on a zero-turn mower. So you're coming straight forward. You want to turn a little bit into your Y. So you left with your Y. Then you want to back up into the other hook of your other Y. proper three-point turn. Alright guys, Savannah's blowing this bed out down here real fast because this tree's starting to shed its leaves for the season. So we like keeping it cleaned out. We blow it out before we do any mowing so we can mulch them all up and keep rocking and rolling. I'm not going to be filming a whole lot today guys. I forgot the tripod and the Joby at home. So yeah, kind of makes filming a bit harder.
turn to get started. All right, guys, got to film a little bit on this one, Savannah film. The mower's cutting great, striping up beautiful. Looks really good, looks really good. Savannah's up here finishing it off. We had to do a little bit of weed pulling on this one. But yeah, mower's running great. Savannah! If I can't go to sleep, you can't go to sleep. I'm not going to sleep. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We had lunch. Savannah's in a food coma now. Do you want to talk to us about what you had for dessert? I didn't have nothing for dessert. <laughs> She had hey, something for dessert. Hey, I've been doing really good, so I thought I needed to, to, to treat myself. Yeah, you look like you needed to treat yourself. I sure I'll did. kick back ready to go to sleep. <laughs> anyway, Savannah, we had Grecian salads. Is that what they're called, Savannah? Yeah, I guess. Hold on, guys. I'm hopping on the highway here. So we had Grecian salads. Really good. And then Savannah goes and ruins it with what? A chocolate brownie. Not just a small chocolate brownie. Like a humongous. It was this big. No, it was not. This thing was like four inches by four inches squared off by probably an inch and a half thick topped with whipped cream and a cherry. It was like lava cake. It was so good. I took one little nibble off the corner. Man, it was rich. But I'll tell you what, it was good. I haven't had chocolate in forever. Way too sweet for me though, way too sweet. But anyways, we've been rocking and rolling through them today. Savannah's been slacking, trying to take naps all freaking day. Oh crap. You have. I'm no slacker. Uh-huh. I mean, I how many steps you up to on your Fitbit? 18,000 million. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, guys, we're right here, kind of the uh, centralized Canton, and I need to take the Echo 770 up to Belts and drop it off so they can check it out for me. Uh, basically what happened is... Sean broke it. <laughs> I didn't break it. The uh, equipment defender rack, uh, I've already been in touch with them, showed them what happened with some pictures and stuff, and they said that they're making some modifications to some things and stuff, but uh, basically what happened is the rack arm that holds it inside of the cage on the equipment defender rack, it ended up cutting through the cable, the throttle cable, on the handle itself but closer i'll show you guys here in a second when we get parked but close to the housing of the unit we didn't notice it uh when it was stored on the trailer and we really didn't use it there for about a month or so holy crap look at them guys up there dude them dudes are up there all right guys so this is what happened basically See the cable here? It cut through it. Let me pull it out of here real fast. But basically, guys, you can see here that rubbed it off, cut through it. The uh, the brake on the X mark was having some slippage in it, like it wasn't real tight. So, ah, uh, shoot. Can't get out this way. Uh, got a truck and a. Uh, let me think here. Uh, can I go around that way? I'm gonna have to continue this in a second, guys. The brake wasn't tight and it was kind of moving a little bit on the trailer, just turning sideways, the mower was. So Mike went ahead and adjusted the uh, brake pad real fast. Just took him a couple minutes and uh, went ahead and dropped off the Echo 770. And uh, basically looked at it real quick and said we just need to replace that whole cable, the handle and all. So they're actually going to order me uh, that whole handle system for the Echo and just replace it. He said it's the cheaper, easier way to go about it what, rather than just trying to replace a little piece here or there. So I had to get that taken care of, especially with, you know, lease season going to be kicking off here in the next couple months. So we're going to need that bad boy. Ain't that right, Savannah? Yes, we are. Well, you are. But hey, we're working our way up north here. Uh, like I already said in the earlier video, I didn't bring the tripod or the Joby today and that sucks because it's kind of hard to film whenever you're mowing and everything and or trying to record trimming unless one of us stands there as you guys have seen in the video. So as always guys. I think the sugar from that brownie is getting to Savannah. <laughs> I'm 
<laughs> so as always, guys. Keep mowing. Keep growing. Keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. TQL.